Working out, a priority in every person's life that has lost its spot in our daily schedules due to how fast-paced our lives have become. Staying healthy has always been encouraged, but it's extremely sad to see the number of people who lose their lives due to health reasons that are under their control every single year. I personally believe that people would be much more consistent with working out and the concept of staying healthy if they identified their why. I agree, finding your why is much easier said than done. So I'll take you through my whys in hopes of helping you find yours. I was always a football slash soccer fanatic. This was my go-to escape from stress and pressure of school and a great way to exercise my mind and body. As the years went by and as I accumulated injuries, my body grew frail and I became extremely injury prone. I needed to find something to help me strengthen my body. This was my first why. So after hours of Google searching, home workouts with no equipment, I was introduced to calisthenics or body weight training. I was instantly attracted to it not only because of how physically demanding it was, but also because it was extremely mentally stimulating. That was my second why. I learned the true meaning of taking a deep breath and exhaling out all the negative energy. I also learned what it was like to establish that mind-muscle connection to help the body move as a unit. And to be quite frank, I loved the natural build it gave me over the years, which was my third why. So for three years, I had great reasons to practice this sport in parallel to football. However, after my ACL injury, playing football was no longer an option for me, and I needed this sport to take over its spot. Calisthenics was the obvious option. That was my fourth why. I needed something to help me release all the stress and pressure from all the advanced classes and projects. That was my fifth why. Now, some people like to think of things from a why not perspective. So here are a few of my why nots. The first thing I could think of is all the negative energy that would stay inside me if I don't work out. The second is the deterioration of my body, especially since I'm a computer engineer. And careers using such a degree requires hours upon hours of sitting in front of a laptop. Another reason is the feeling of rejuvenation at the end of a workout that I would be missing out on. So what I discussed in this video were just my reasons. If you've been struggling to stay consistent with working out, try and identify your why and why not reasons. They can be completely unique to you, your life and needs. Just keep searching for something to help you express yourself and instantly take your mind and body to a peaceful temporary place that's far away from our fast-paced world.